Right, here we have the 2010 Fiat Ducato from the police service. It was originally used as some form of mobile office. Um, it's, a, it's a Zuckoff uh, Fiat Ducato version, which basically means it's a chassis cab. Uh, it's running the three litre chain driven engine with a six speed manual transmission. So it's a pretty good setup. I'll just show you inside the cab. Here's the battery isolated switch, so engage that. Oops. And it has only done 13,499 miles. As you can see, the cab is very tidy. But I suppose the most important thing is, what's the body like for you? It does have an awning up top. It's a pretty, pretty uh, strong build quality. Everything just feels, I don't know, very good quality. It's got a side step there. I think this here um, was some sort of access point because that just goes into the back, which I'll get to in the second. And on the offside rear here, there's a, a 240 volt charging point, um, and that's essentially where the generator was inside inside that cabin. But they have removed it, so it does not have a generator. So the only way to give power to it presently um, is by giving it hookup. As you can see, we've just got the window there. So, a bit of a, an, an L-shaped seating area here. Huge ceilings. Skylight. As you can see, they kept us with the generator controller, but that, of course, is connected to nothing, so that's completely useless. Um, and here's a control panel for the lights. Um, we have tested it with um, 12 volt power because they've removed the leisure batteries here as well. Um, I imagine um, that was one of them probably was for the uh, generator as well. Microwave. We have, it's dark for some reason. Some reason my camera is dark, but there's a Victron um, charger here and inverter. So my guys could wire this up in any configuration you wanted. If you wanted lithium batteries, we could do that, or we could indeed install a generator again. Air conditioning up top. So we've tried all this out. So this all works. Just an electric heater there. Yeah, this is just a sort of a, an empty room with a bit of storage capability and an extraction fan in the ceiling. So, onto the dimensions. The length of this room here is four meters and the room at the back is one meter. So if you were to take it all out, you'd have a five meter open space. The standing height is 2.3 meters, pretty good. Uh, and the width is 2.3 meters as well. So yeah, that pretty much concludes the video. Vehicle welcome to my the toilet MOT. We'll ensure it's serviced. If you have any questions, please give us a shout.